Hey everyone, my name is Jamie Lee. Welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching this video today. Now today we are back with the first swimsuit video of 2024. Welcome back. Welcome to the new year. I know a lot of people tend to take vacations in the winter months and if not in the winter, you're probably planning to do something for March break. Unfortunately, I am not, but I still have you covered with some new swimsuits from Cupshe. Now Cupshe was kind enough to send me these free of charge. That does not mean I need to only say nice things things about them and I will as always give you my honest opinions about them. Specifically this time they sent me a bunch of swimsuits from their tummy control line which I will be honest I do kind of feel like I need at this time of year more than any other time. I always tend to overeat over the holidays. I get a lot of like little sweet treats as part of my stocking and most of those are already gone by New Year's. I definitely spend like that week between Christmas and New Year's just like a glutton <laughs> playing video games and eating eating snacks. So if there was ever a time to test like tummy control swimsuits, it's right now. And one thing that I do want to get out of the way, specifically in this video, we're going to be trying on high-waisted bottoms that are disguising and kind of sucking in the tummy a little bit and some one pieces. If you like low-rise bikinis and you do have a tummy, I think that that is absolutely fantastic. I have a couple low-rise bikinis too and I would still wear them even now. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. Never let anybody make you feel ashamed for liking what you like but there's also no shame in if you're not feeling your most confident today throwing on something that maybe has a little bit of ruching or a very loud pattern that's going to disguise the things that you're a little bit uncomfortable with and make you feel confident enough to go enjoy your day without worrying about your body and while this is the first swimsuit video of 2024 I'm certain it won't be the last so if you do enjoy swimsuit reviews hauls I also love to look at fashion clothing active wear any of those things be sure to hit the subscribe button and the little bell notification button to be notified when I post. I've been posting a minimum of one to two long videos like this every week and like four or five shorts every single week for months now. <laughs> we'll see if that continues for all of 2024 or if I get burnt out from that but making videos is my passion and I would be so happy for you to come along with me. Now like always I will link to the exact swimsuit that I got and include which of the colorways that I got it in down in the description box. I will also include Include what size I got each one in but in general I got every single swimsuit you're going to see today in a size medium and since we're talking about cup sheet I do want to mention they do carry plus sizes in a lot of their swimsuits but it's not always one-to-one -one. so sometimes you might find the exact same swimsuit in a plus size sometimes it might be like slightly different sometimes the plus size has cuter ones than the standard sizes if I'm being honest so just keep that in mind as you're browsing the website they do also sell a lot of of bikinis both pieces as a set but often you can choose your size for both pieces still which is really nice and then sometimes they do also sell things as separates so if you're just looking for a new black bikini bottom just search in their separates section and you will be able to find that and with that let's get right into it with this first swimsuit I think a lot of people will consider this pattern a little bit loud I absolutely love it I think that this is so cute I absolutely love the florals I think that they look beautiful and the fact that the straps are like this really nice deep purple color, I think that they look fantastic together. Now, as we're talking about tummy control swimsuits, I wouldn't say that this one is like sucking you in or anything. So if you are looking for something with a bit more support, this one doesn't necessarily have that. What it does have is a lot of ruching and a very loud pattern that is going to make it so you don't really notice your tummy at all. People are going to be looking at the pattern and saying, wow, she picks such a bright, colorful swimsuit. Oh my gosh, looks great on her. They're not going to notice your stomach. I personally sometimes get a little annoyed in swimsuits when you can see my belly button just like sticking out. Like you can really, really see where the hole of my belly button is. I know that that's a weird thing to worry about, but sometimes I do. And with this one, because of the ruching and because of that loud pattern, you're never going to see that. I usually wear around a 34 double D to triple D up top. And I feel like this is doing a great job of supporting things, lifting things, and it feels really comfortable. The straps are not digging in which is nice and the back of this is not super cheeky it's actually pretty full coverage and then it does have a cutout along with adjustable straps on those center two straps so if you do need a bit more support you can tighten those to get it lifted a little bit higher overall I absolutely love this one I will 100% be keeping this and wearing it I think it is super cute the type of swimsuit you could wear to anything with little kids with family with friends it doesn't matter it's just cute wholesome and a great choice 
choice. All right, next up we've got the first bikini of the bunch, which is this really cute like leafy green pattern. I always love like a leafy or a floral pattern in bathing suits, but do keep in mind they also have tons of like solid colors, lots of like black solid pieces if you don't necessarily love a bright pattern, but I always find it really fun to show off some of the more unique patterns and prints that they have because they do have some that are really cool that I haven't seen anywhere else. This pattern is like this really cute like floral in a leafy green which I think is so cute and this bottom is what I think most people are looking for when they say they want like a tummy control swimsuit. It does have a bit of compression across the tummy and then it's obviously quite high waisted and that compression ends before this little crossover waistband part so you don't have to worry about it like digging in and making it look like you have like rolls over the top or some muffin top which I do find sometimes tummy control swimsuits can just do that and then I feel like that looks worse on me than just having my tummy out on display. So there is the bit of compression across the tummy. It's not too much. It's not going to make you feel sick. I think it feels fine. I do think that it is flattening things out just a little bit. Like I said, I'm quite bloated right now <laughs> because I have been eating not well for the last few days. And then this crossover waist does kind of draw the eye to the smallest part of you to your waist, which I think is helpful if you're trying to feel a little more confident. This one does have a slightly higher cut leg than most of the other options that we're going to look at today, which I will always say if you're short, I do think a higher cut leg does make you look a lot taller. Usually there is a sacrifice in that it is a little cheekier at the back, but this one is pretty full coverage in my opinion. Now the top on this is really good support and I actually feel like I could fit more in these cups, which is not usually an experience I have. Usually I'm spilling out of them in a lot of swimsuits. So if you have a larger bust, this might be a good one to try for you. The back of this is just like a little hook and eye. So you can adjust the band length. I just have it on the second tightest one right now. And overall, I feel like this one looks really good. I find it super flattering. It's very comfortable. It is providing a little bit of flattening out of the tummy region. And I would definitely feel comfortable wearing this one once again with like anybody. It's not too cheeky. There's not too much cleavage. For a bikini, I think that it looks decently modest while still being very, very cute in my opinion. Now next up, we have this little purple sparkly number and I really, really like this one. I think that it looks really beautiful. However, one thing I will point out, you can definitely see the belly button that I was talking about previously. This one does have a lot of ruching, but I feel like ruching can only do so much for the dreaded belly button pit. <laughs> and once again, I do want to be clear, nobody else cares or notices your belly button. That is something that you look at in the mirror and think, oh, that doesn't look that good. I wish I had a super flat stomach. Nobody else is judging you for that, especially not your like friends and family and truly who cares what some random stranger thinks anyways. Now the back of this one, once again, fairly full coverage. I would say slightly cheekier than some of the other ones that we've looked at, but still pretty much full coverage. And this one does hit me a little bit lower on the leg, which does mean that in my opinion, it makes my legs look a little bit shorter and I'm already very, very short. So I don't need help looking shorter. The the way that this one is cut, I do think that it helps to really like accentuate your curves. It has sort of these panels on the side that have like some extra ruching on the side and then a separate ruching across the tummy. And overall, it is a quite comfortable bathing suit. So if you're just looking for like a nice comfy one piece, this could be a good option. I don't think that it is like holding in my tummy necessarily, but it does have a lot more structure to it than a standard swimsuit that you you might go buy it like American Eagle or something. So perhaps it is doing a little something. It's just not like a ton. It doesn't feel like shapewear. This one does have removable pads in it but it doesn't really have like a built-in shelf bra or anything. Your boobs are just kind of in here. So if you need something with more support, this one does not necessarily offer a ton of support. I still think that the neckline looks really nice and really flattering with kind of like the square neck, but things are just sitting as they would naturally sit. They're not being lifted. And this one does also have adjustable straps. So if you need an adjustable strap, that is there, but that's just going to lift the neckline higher. It's not necessarily going to lift your chest higher. So just keep that in mind. Overall, I do think that it's cute. 
I don't necessarily know if I would reach for this over say that first like purple floral one. I think that one just fit my body type a little bit better and I did like that that one had some more support for the breasts. All right, next up we have another bikini option and this is one for all of the black lovers. This one is basically a basic black bikini but with the addition of these little sheer mesh panels both under your bust and at the top of the bottoms which I do think are cute. I do think that they're in interesting. Of all of the suits we've tried so far today, this one definitely has the least amount of like actual support or like tummy control. However, it's black and it's high-waisted, so I do think that it's still going to give you a little bit of like a slimming effect if that's what you're looking for. It does come up quite high, but a big portion of that is this see-through mesh part, so it's really only coming to just below my belly button on me for the full real swimsuit bottoms. Once again, these are not very high cut, which means that they are pretty full coverage at the back. And I do want to mention, like, Cupshe has many very, very cheeky swimsuit options. And you can watch some of my previous Cupshe videos to see some that are a little more high cut, a little more cheeky. But with the tummy control options, I do think that they tend to be a little bit more on the conservative side in terms of cheekiness and high cutness. Now, the top on this one, once again, I feel like I have loads of room in this top. Like, I could easily have an additional one or two cup sizes and not fully fill this out, which I appreciate. I feel like once again, I'm usually spilling out of bikini tops. I do think that this one is cute. It does have the crisscross straps on the top, which once again are adjustable so you can make those a little tighter. And I do think I would probably opt to make them slightly tighter just for a little more support. But overall, I do think that this suit is very cute. I think something in black is always going to be timeless. And this one does have the little bit of extra something something with those mesh panels which I do think are cute. I just don't think that if you're looking for like tummy control specifically I don't think you're getting a ton of that here. It's more so just a nice high-waisted black bottom that therefore is disguising your tummy a little bit. And then last but certainly not least we have this really cute little ruffly floral one piece. Now one of the things that I do think can help if you're feeling like a little bit self-conscious is to be more extra. And this is something that I do in like my regular everyday dressing as well. If you're dressed just like a little more extra than other people, I really feel like that already exudes some extra self-confidence and nobody is going to come up to you and be like, wow, your stomach looks really big in that. For some reason, people just leave you alone. And I can't explain it, but I've definitely noticed it in my regular everyday life. So this swimsuit, I would consider to be just like a little bit extra, maybe not quite as much as this first one where the pattern is so bright and different that people are just going to be like, wow, I love your swimsuit. It's so bright. Oh my God, I love that pattern. People will compliment you on this all day. I know because like this is the type of thing that I often wear on a regular basis and people always have something nice to say. But this one still has obviously the pretty loud floral print. It has ruffles. It's got the halter back and it also has a bunch of ruching and it kind of looks like it could maybe be a tankini but then it's actually a one piece this is all one solid piece it has just enough going on that I think people will be a little too distracted to even notice your stomach or your body at all so this one does have lots of ruching over the tummy however I do find it a little odd it stops here so just before your lower tummy, which is what I usually am more self-conscious about versus any other part. And I know like from friends that have had kids or had C-sections, like that's the part that they usually want hidden a little bit. So it is an odd choice to me that that ruching kind of stops right before that part. But what, like I said, there is a ton of ruching. So if you do want something that's really gonna cover up your belly button or your tummy, this could be an okay option for you. It is fairly low cut. And there's actually not a ton of support in here despite it being a halter. Usually I find with halters like I can get a lot of support and like really hold things up. With this one there's no like shelf bra or seam underneath your bust to like help you do that. So if I pull this up, things are just slipping down within it. This suit is probably my least favorite of all of them. I think that it's okay. And once again, there is a lot going on if you just want a little bit of a distraction, but I do think you're going to get even more of that 
effect with something like this. And this one also had a lot more support for the bust. And in my opinion, was just a little bit more flattering versus this one. I do think that we got some really cute swimsuits today. I particularly love that first purple floral one and then also that green bikini. I think both of those are absolutely adorable and ones that I will definitely wear again. But like always, be sure to let me know what you think. Sometimes we disagree and that's okay. And like I mentioned before, I will have links to all the swimsuits down in the description box. So if you do wanna check them out, you can find them down there. And I will have links to just like the Cupshe website in general if you want to check it out. They do have some really good, really cute, affordable swimsuits. And I personally have suits from them that I bought before I got engaged, which would be like five years ago at this point. And they look just as good as the day I got them. And with that, that's going to be all for me today. Once again, happy new year. I'm happy to have you with me here in 2024. And with that, I hope that you have a fabulous day and that I will see you next time. Bye.